Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the 50th annual Joe Weeders Mr. Olympia. Ladies and gentlemen, the voice of professional bodybuilding, Bob Chicarillo. This guy's great. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, fans from around the world, welcome to Joe Weeder's 50th Olympia. <laughs> Folks, what started off as a dream back in 1965, and two competitors on stage, a crown going to the victor, Larry Scott, has now turned into a $1.1 million Olympia experience. And folks, as we celebrate Joe's 50th here in Las Vegas again this year, it's become apparent that obviously this is the, the biggest showcase that we have in bodybuilding. This year marks the first year in 30 years, since 1984, that NBC Sports will be covering the Olympia weekend. And a big congratulations to Robin Chang, the Olympia promoter, and the entire Olympia crew that's worked uh, painstakingly all year long to bring that prize money up over a million dollars to get NBC on board. And folks, as you've seen here today, by the line out there and that one seat empty, we are sold out in capacity here. Friday and Saturday nights also look like they are sold out at the arena. Can Ty Green take out Phil Heath? Will the Big Bad Wolf spoil the show? Or will they all go down to the feet against the beast from the east, Big Rami? As you can see, folks, we've got those competitors, those superstars are here in attendance, and of course more. We have 17 of the best bodybuilders in the world. Let's hit that music and let's bring them out. Olympia fans, are you ready? Okay. Welcome our first competitor from the USA, Fred Biggie Smalls. Making his Olympia debut from Egypt, Ibrahim Fahim. Also making his Olympia debut from the USA, Jojo Natifero. All the way from Holland, William Bonac. The world's strongest bodybuilder, J.O.J. Johnny. Jackson! Making his Olympia debut from the USA, John De La Rosa. Making his Olympia debut from the USA, give it up for Big Diesel, Juan Morrell. From the USA, here comes the King Snake, Steve Kuklo. From the Dominican Republic, Victor Martinez. From the USA, the Texas Titan, Branch Warren. From Egypt, Mamdoa, Big Robbie Elsbaye. From Curacao.
song in the Netherlands, Rui Winkler. From the USA, your 2008 Mr. Olympia, the play, Dexter Jackson. From the USA, Lexatron Sean Roden. From Germany, Dennis Big Ben Wolf. From the USA, the Predator Kai Green. And your final competitor from the USA, your three time and reigning Olympia champion, the gift. Phil P. I'm going to go right to Phil. Speak to the channel. Phil, three time Miss Olympia, you come in here, you get your fourth title. We had a conversation last year at this very same time on this stage about a guy that's coming to defeat you. Yeah. Who signed the postal last year as the 2013 Mr. Olympia. Now, yesterday, Mr. Green signed the postal again with the 2014 Mr. Olympia. What does Phil Heath say to that? First of all, just want to say thank you all for coming out. I mean, this is amazing. It's definitely because of you all that have uh, made this event possible. Um, I heard that we have a capacity crowd out here. I can't really see, but I mean, it looks to me that there's not a seat in the house. So, I mean, you know, thank you all for coming. It really means a lot to not just myself, but all these amazing athletes. Um, with that said, answer the question. Had I mean, let's be serious. I mean, haven't you learned from last year what you did? And, and let's be serious. I mean, all, all jokes aside, there's been 13 Mr. Olympias. They've all had the right, you know, they've earned that right to be able to write that on anything. So don't disrespect the game. The people that root for you, that root for that type of behavior, I just don't understand it. This is ridiculous, but uh, the, the greatest thing about it, the cool thing about it is, is that uh, just like I said last year, you know, I'll be able to write that four time on Sunday, and it's gonna feel really good. It's gonna feel real nice. Retire? Who's that? Oh, Mr. George Farrell. Oh, gosh. Speak this, up. This guy? This guy? Oh, man. This is. So, um, you know, real quick, we won't, we won't address these guys. I mean, I'm going to address my trainer, Hani Rambod. And, uh, you know, Hani and I have, you know, worked together for quite some time. And uh, this gentleman has not lost an Olympia since, uh, I want to say, 2009. He's done a great job getting guys like myself, you know, in perfect shape. And that's what we intend to do, you know, tomorrow night. Um, enough trash talk. I mean... We've done our talk and we've earned three sandals. I mean, to your zero, George. So I mean, you need to just sit back, relax, and uh, let, let the sandals talk, man. Get out of here. All right, Kai Green, the predator. You've heard the champ speak. Phil, he feels disrespected. You have desecrated the title. 
of Olympia champion by writing it in advance. Did you not learn your lesson from last year, Kai? Wow. This guy's this amazing. This is wonderful. This guy's, this guy's amazing. Thank you, everyone, for coming out and supporting us today. This is really, 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 really big. It's a Brooklyn boy. Um, this is an amazing weekend we have in store for you all because we're going to show you how talk is so cheap. It's so cheap. The past is the past. And we need to respect what was done in the past because it's already been written. But the truth is, the future, the future is what we represent this weekend. This weekend, we will show you what the future brings. And I'm very, very proud to represent those people that believe and think about the power of unlimited potential and the future being not dictated by the past. The past is the past. In the future, though, you don't need to address George in the audience because you won't stand on stage against George. I represent what George is bringing. You just make it hard. You do what you're supposed to do. And we'll show you what we can do this weekend. It's like a real war to me. I mean, you know, this is this is great. This is what the 50th Olympia is all about, guys. I mean, you guys, you guys wanted it. We're gonna bring it. You know, and that's what it's all about. You know, obviously tensions are very high. We all want to be Mr. Olympia. That's what we train for. That's what we all got into this sport to do. Is to become a champion. Now, all these guys have earned their right to challenge for that title. Kai, I'm gonna tell you something, man. You haven't earned a point. You haven't earned a point. A point in four and a half years. It's subjective. That's bodybuilding. Like, what? But know, at the end of the day, I'll tell you this. I'll tell you great. this. I want you to be just as gracious on Sunday. <laughs> I can't wait to hear your interview on Sunday. This is great. I, I want to look you in your eyes on Sunday. Hey. I'm yeah. waiting for Sunday. That's great. Yeah. People that are looking forward to Sunday. Yeah. I got a lot of for Sunday right, right now. Okay. But I'm gonna enjoy Saturday and Friday when we show what you ain't got. Oh man, this how is about great. that? This is great. How about that? This is great. This is gonna sound so great. This is gonna be beautiful. It's beautiful. You see how I'm saying that? Hey man, when you get desperate, hey, when you get desperate, you make faces like this, man. Desperate? It's not desperate. I'm gonna show you desperate when we do those quarter turns. Talk is cheap, man. I mean, we, you know, we've done this. We've when done you get this finished, dance. go to the hotel room and say a prayer. We've done this dance, man. Go to your hotel room and say a prayer. Three zero. Say a prayer. Three say zero. The Sunday is here. Maybe. Excuse me. Break, break, break. Maybe we should just let George and Holly duke it out. Now then. And it's not who's going to be crowned as the champ. It's not going to be whether Kai can do whatever he said he's going to do. It's not going to be whether Phil can make it a four-peat. That's a word. But it's going to be that we will have the greatest Olympia in the history of the Olympia. Celebrating Joe Meter's 50th right here in Las Vegas, Nevada. And I'm expecting, from what we saw today, you can expect a serious war going on on that stage. And I don't think it's just going to be a war between Phil and Kai. I think there's going to be a few more guys in there battling it out. And I'm 100% convinced that this will be the best Olympia ever. I bet there is no question, my friend. On behalf of Jim Mannion and the IFBB, Robin Chang, and the entire Olympia production staff, I'd like to thank everybody for coming out here today. Folks, to meet the Olympians, you can meet all these champions tonight, 7 o'clock. 7 o'clock right upstairs for VIP entrance, 8 o'clock. It's wide open, folks. They have all kinds of merchandise for sale. Of course, you can get a chance to just shake hands with the champs and uh, give them your two cents on what's going to be going on for this weekend. Folks, it's going to wrap things up for here for Dennis the Menace James. I'm Bob Chick. Thanks for coming out. I'll be seeing you guys tonight. See you tonight.